What's up YouTube fans? Today we're going to be unboxing the Mastermind Creations TFCon Toronto 2022 exclusive from Ages 3 and up and I guess Madhouse also is working together on their Optus Prominion which is a shattered glass version of Optimus Prime. Now I did hear right before the convention this is actually going to end up being available uh, for mass release but there will be slight differences in the deco. This one is unique for TF Cut. So let's get this out of here. It does have a slip cover. Nothing on the back. It just has the words there. Some nice artwork here. Really nice artwork. They mentioned who the artwork was by, but I forgot. All right, there is the box. Um, it is taped here. I'm going to have to... Oh, okay. You got it open. And again, I mentioned this in my previous unboxing, but I will have to uh, excuse my lighting and excuse the, the setup I have here because I'm not in my normal normal place. So you do get the collector's card. Let's take a look at this. By the way, this is going to my friend Dr. Diecast. He loves shattered glass. So shout out to him. There's the collector's card. He's got some really high stats. There's the instruction booklet. They actually changed it for this particular release, because you can see they've got the, on the cover. The instructions are the same. I did review the original Optus Pexus, so you can check out that review if you're interested. That's what's new. Dang, look at that. That's pretty awesome. So this axe is new. These guns are the same as before. Uh, this looks new, so I'll have to check that out. These are the same as before, although you didn't always get them. There were some releases of Optus Pexus that didn't include these. Uh, but here are the heads. You get two heads. Now one is a... Here, let's get this out of here because we're going to want to look at this. And hopefully I can get this out of here without hurting myself. Fortunately, I don't have a knife with me. I'm going to have to rip this bag. Well, let's get this open first then. And this is also taped. And this is what happens when you're doing a review away from home without camera and without the ability to edit anything. <laughs> you guys get to see all of my raw footage here. So let's get him set up here. Looking pretty good. Look at those colors. You got the purple. You do have a nice shattered piece of glass right there. Got the bullet holes. I believe this deco is going to be different on the mass release. There's the legs. Sorry about my camera. It's not the best. Oh, I cut myself. Hey, I'm pink for life. <laughs> I cut myself opening the packaging. All right, here you go. Here's the back. That's inside joke for people. If you don't know what that means, go watch Pig for Life's channel. He likes to draw blood. So I finally did it on my channel. Oops. Don't fall down. All right, there we go. He is stable. I just didn't have him set up right. All right, I gotta, how am I going to get this open? I'm going to have to take this off camera. Now, I have previously damaged stuff trying to open it on camera, so I'm doing it off camera. But I can't edit this out because I have my editing software here. So look at that. That's really beautiful. Got that nice, it's a good gradient. You got the green, you got the blue. Silver paint, wow, that's really nice. And yeah, I'm, here's the, I guess this is the handle. Oh, so the, I need one more part here. Yeah, here you go. So how does this go together? I'd imagine this goes into here, and then this goes into here, yeah. Look at that thing. Dang. I'm just going to put in his hand for now while I get the other accessories out. So you have something to look at while I'm fiddling behind the camera here. And yeah, this is just an unboxing. I will do a full review on this guy later. Um, after we leave TFCon and after I get home and have my regular camera and setup, it'll be a lot better for you guys see it more clearly and you can also not have to deal with me opening packaging in front of you. 
So again, I have previously damaged things opening them like this on camera, so I'm going to try to be careful. Especially since I'm giving this to my buddy. Here's the alternate face. So if you like the unmasked face look, you can have this. That's pretty cool. I'm not going to put it on right now. Merely just wanted to show you guys. And this one looks really cool. I kind of like this. But this is the original. Looks like the original head. I don't know why they do this. It, Mastermind and Fans Hobby, they, they pack it up so tight. Here's the... Looks like the original head. It's in, it's in blue, so if you prefer this darker bluish color, it doesn't match the purple, but... Um, really neat. Really cool. The Matrix is different. So the Matrix is green now. Instead of the red that we got with the black version and then the regular standard one we got with the Optus Pexus. Uh, and then these guns are the same, so I'm not going to take them out of package. I just want to confirm they are the same as the original. So let's take a look at this guy. He does feel good. No, doesn't feel like any mold degradation. Everything's nice and tight. Really good joints. So yeah, looks great. Uh, stay tuned for the full review on this guy on the channel and that'll be probably um, next week when I get back to uh, home where I can actually film it and edit it. So stay tuned. We'll see you then.